How was your childhood, man? Uh, it was very bad, but fun. Yeah? <laughs> That's crazy. I mean, for me, most of all, I have fun, really. I ain't gonna lie. I have fun. What was your favorite childhood memory? Um, my favorite childhood memory. I guess learning how to DJ because I still do it to this day. <laughs> yeah? Yeah. So that, how like, was your music come up and who helped you out? Um, well, how can I say it? DJ Mark Love from the far side, Zulu Tribe, Zulu Nation Tribe, uh, Battle Cat, DJ Aladdin, DJ Crazy Tunes, Rest in Peace, people like them. I grew up with them. Yeah. So and King T is my cousin. So we all, you know, in the same area, friends hanging out with friends. And I'm the, the kid kid hanging out with teenagers that do yeah. music. So, you know, they put me on that way. So how do you feel that we're living in a generation? Like literally some DJs are more popular than their, the rapper or the artist they work with. Like, how does that make you feel? Um, well... I guess to me that says the DJ is better than that rap artist. Yeah. Basically. Because if they're not giving 50-50, yeah. you know what I mean? Because at the end of the day, don't get me wrong, DJs are number one front stage just as well as the rapper, the artist, the MC. Front yeah. stage, they're just as well. They go hand in hand. So, I mean, per uh, personally, if they're and cahoots with each other yeah the balance is going to be right there there is no i'm better than you I'm, you're better than me yeah. but it also depends on what that particular dj is doing you get what i'm saying yeah, like I that do. dj might be doing more than just djing you get what i'm saying yeah and then again you know like i said it can be the dj's more talented or giving more skills than that particular artist and how about near-death experience and worst fear? Uh, near-death experience, uh, have I really had those? I had a few of those, but I don't know if you were, oh yeah, I guess bullets grazing your head. Yeah. <laughs> There's near-death car, ex car accidents, well, a car accident I was in. Damn. Took my thumb completely off. Fuck, that's crazy, Yeah, man. you can see the scar all the way around my thumb, all the way Damn. around. It literally left me like this, but my thumb was hanging by like half an inch yeah. of meat. It's fucking Bone crazy, broke, man. veins done, but the doctors were good doctors, and they... <laughs> no BS. <laughs> and how about uh, uh, your worst fear? My worst fear? Mm. I don't know. That's a good one. Uh... I don't know. I can't, I guess, really say my worst fear because I don't yeah. think of negativity. Yeah. And to me, my worst fear is negativity. That is You get what bad. I'm saying? Because yeah. <laughs> I'm afraid of it. Yeah. But for me, I guess if I don't think about it, I'm not worried about it. I'm enjoying myself doing what I love. Yeah. I don't, I don't think I have time to think in that manner. And uh, what superhero would you be? What superhero? Oh, shit. That's a good one. Huh. I don't know. Probably Superman. Oh, well, he's cool. Because he's multiple. He has multiple powers. Yeah. But. Well, I can't say but because the majority of the, all of them are the same. Some just have more powers than others. Well, I guess Superman. I guess I would say Superman. And how about Godzilla or King Kong? Godzilla or King Kong? Damn. That's a good one. Godzilla or King Kong? Shit. Damn. You fucked me up with that one. I ain't gonna even lie. Hmm. I'm gonna say Godzilla. Fuck. How about, uh, would you be a graffiti artist, a visual artist, or a VFX artist? Graffiti all the way because I used to do that shit when I was little. I was a tagger. <laughs> wow. I used to be a tagger when I was little. <laughs> Who, well, who's younger. some of your favorite uh, graffiti artists? Um, shit. I ain't gonna even lie. I can't even tell you right now. Yeah. I haven't really been so much on it. I just 
like the way certain things look. I'm not gonna even lie. And there's a lot of dope art out there. Yeah. And there's a lot of dope artists out there. But me personally, I would take graffiti. Why? Because that's where everything else you just named came yeah. from. And what horror movie character would you be? Horror character. Saw, because he like playing games. <laughs> yeah, he's amazing. And would you be a puzzle, a hot sauce, or a warehouse? Um, a puzzle. A uh, hot sauce or warehouse? Warehouse, because I could store all of that. And uh, would you be a Muppet, Alvin Chipmunks, or all real monster character? Muppet, Chipmunks, or? All real monsters. Probably the Muppet, because they've been around the longest. Who's your favorite? Kermit. <laughs> and would you be Dr. Seuss, Game of Thrones, or Stranger Things character? Stranger Things. Famous girl you go with on a date? Oh, shit. A mortician? How about a castle or a virtuality machine? Castle. What pattern would you be? Mm. I don't know. <laughs> what are my choices? <laughs> uh, well, Triangle, I mean, circle, I don't know. Yeah. What the hell? And how about would you be a mechanic, a translator, or someone who gives citizenship? Um, sure. I will do citizenship. Would you be a wall ball master, a hockey sap champion, or a drone racer? Or a who? Or a drone racer. Drone racer. God damn it, that shit is fun. I got a drone. <laughs> and would you be a love guru, exterminator, or executioner? Lover. How about a therapist, a psychic, or food designer? Food designer. Astronomer, a mathematician, or taxidermist? Mathematician. Uh, what rock band would you be in? ACDC. Oh, they're amazing. What's your favorite song from them? Uh, shit, really, I like all of them. I mean, really, I like. I grew up on on that type of shit. Cause before hip hop, I'm older than y'all. Yeah. Think. <laughs> but you know, I like a lot of that records. And would you be in a bomber, landscaper, or wedding planner? A bomb. A a bomber, a landscaper, or wedding planner. Landscaper. How about Disney character you'd be? Um, probably Goofy. Oh, he's amazing. I'll probably say Goofy because he's one of the most known, but I mean, most loved, but yeah. least known. And how about your dream vacation? Dream vacation. Mm. I never thought of that. Uh, honestly, I never thought of that. What soda would you be? What soda would I be? I would be, uh, Probably a Sprite. How about candy? It's clear, it's pure. <laughs> yeah. And it tastes pretty good. And what candy would you be? Candy. A Snicker. We oh. can't get enough. They are really good. <laughs> They're satisfying. And would you be stuck in a quantum realm, a wormhole, or upside down realm? What is it? A uh, quantum realm, a wormhole, or upside down realm? Probably a quantum realm. And uh, last ones. Uh, where do you see yourself in the next five years? In the next five years, doing what I'm doing now. DJing, making the people smile, having fun, doing what I love to do. And uh, a few random facts about you? A few random facts about you? A few random facts about me. Um, I've been in this longer than y'all probably think I have. <laughs> and uh, E.T., a gremlin, a troll, Spongebob, Scooby-Doo, cat dog, or Felix the cat? Felix! I appreciate it, man. No problem. Thank you, man. Yes, sir. Thank, Thank you, sir Brad. <laughs>